All right. We will wait for a couple people to come on or more people to join. Uh, hello, everybody. Um, hello, it's me, Jared. So um, today we are going, I'm going to show you guys. Uh, hello, Fox. Hello, Lily. So today I'm going to show you, you see the King's guitars and how they are uh, made. Um, the King has multiple colors. And uh, basically I'm going to show you how that is made. So we have one that's already done right here. And it is a thick vinyl. All right. And that is how, this is one color from his, uh, I believe it was February. It should have been show tape. I don't know if it was show. No, this was on his Save King album uh, or his Save King show tape. So, and this one was never used, the pink one. And it's like a glitter. So it shines um, in the, uh, with the right light. It's kind of not showing right there, but uh, basically it is a facade that is put onto his original guitar. And that is what allows me to change his guitars. And uh, for show tape six, I have his new colors and they are in. So I'm gonna show you how I make his guitar uh, cutouts. Uh, we have his King Cash guitar, which is a black, uh, I'm literally opening them up right now. It's a black vinyl, but it is glitter, glitter vinyl. And opening that up. Now this one's gonna be extra difficult to do because it's black, but it's not impossible. And it takes two of these. I'll let you see it up close here. Okay, uh, and it, it's not really sure. There's a window right in back of us, or in back of the camera. So, but it, it will glitter and shine uh, in, his, in his videos. And then we have the next one, which is gonna be King Life. And these guys aren't cheap. They do cost money at around like uh, $25 a color. So, um, but they are reusable. That's the good, that's the good thing. So this one is called Confetti and you can't really see it in the, uh, it's not the best lighting, but it has a, it has like a glitter to it, um, Confetti glitter. So, and for his show tape finale, if you have checked out the kingrobot.com, you will know that we are doing a parody similar to Show Tape 5's finale. And uh, I'm not gonna give out the secret. Actually, I think this, no, the secret hasn't been given out. Uh, only to a very, very, very few limited audience that knows to keep it a secret. However, he will be in his Jungle Cat 2 outfit. And uh, so that is gonna be his guitar for Show Tape 6's finale, which is really cool. All right, uh, so I'm King Life right now because that is the next one. So what it is, is I've taken his guitar apart a while ago. We gotta get that real flat and I'll show you how we do that. All right, um, I took his guitar apart and I made uh, many moons ago, I made a basically a cutout of his guitar. And that is how those are made. So basically I just stencil it. It's real uh, critical that I get it just right, that I do it just right. So I gotta remember what is the front, because if I do it backwards, I just lost 25 bucks. So I don't wanna do that. And sometimes I'll have to go look at his guitar, but I know that the one with the hole in it is the bottom part. So we're gonna, so I know I'm safe on that. And then when I turn it over, so that's the top, so that works. So I'm gonna line everything up. It doesn't take too long to do, but it does take, uh, you gotta be just extra, extra, extra careful. All right, so I'm gonna make my, markings but i'm going to make sure i'm lined up perfectly so that when it goes onto the guitar it has to be seamless that's what makes the guitar look like 
it's a whole new guitar from even where I cut the cutout. Okay, and the curves and everything has to be uh, cut just right. So now I'm just making the outline. And I know I have to cut inside the black line. And I wish I had multiple camera angles, that way you could actually see as I'm doing it here. And uh, I might uh, do that in a little bit here. But for all of you that are interested in how the king, uh, it takes a lot of work to get all his uh, items ready for different show tapes. And you're talking about maybe a minute or not a minute, a couple minutes to three minutes is a song. So now I did an outline there. So I'll show you that. Oh, can you see that? A lot of glare here. I'm doing this in the kitchen or the dining room, but so I got that. So now we're gonna do the other side. And the back end basically is gonna be right here. I'm gonna use his blue because I don't know where my other cutout is, but they're all exactly the same. But it's real critical that I place it exactly the same to get this other part. Okay. There we go. And I'm just doing the outline. So for those of you that have a animatronic that has an instrument from PTT or uh, RAE, uh, you'll be able to change out your animatronics look without having to change the entire guitar or whatever instrument it is. Um, because if you're doing a show, if you're showing it to the public, or if you're showing it on YouTube, it can be quite expensive to create a whole new wooden piece or plastic piece where you can just overlay the original piece. Because remember, the original piece has cylinders on it, and that would be uh, quite a task, uh, and even more expensive to have new cylinders for each new piece when you could just overlay. All right, so I think we got it. Voila, we have it. I'll show you this up here. So there's that. And that is his uh, Say King, which will be that side, which will be his glitter for his guitar. So there is that. And you have to have, like I said, two pieces for the guitar and I think the other piece the other piece the bottom part is very long so that one has to be done in sections very carefully with the other piece it'll actually be one section and the other section and then they will have double-sided tape on each side and then the guitar just has to be uh, the holes have to be punched in for the uh, knobs, and then voila, then he has a new guitar. So let me get the other one out. So there's a lot to King's various outfits, and at least you get to see behind the scenes on this. And maybe you could use this uh, template or, or idea of constructing a new uh, template on either your animatronic or whatever you have if you want to jazz it up and do different colors. So now this one is going to be this piece, which I'm going to put, oh, no, nope, this piece. And I'm going to line it up right to the edge. And I'm going to make sure I have the other piece, I have enough room, which I've got a perfect amount of room. And then keep the residuals, because I might be able to use them. 
for something else or just toss them. And this is a regular vinyl, uh, non-sticky back. You don't want to put a sticker on there because then you'll, it'll be heck on earth getting it out. So now I just got to make sure which side is which. Like I said, if you do the wrong side, then you mess it up. So that one This Jared is out.